Hey you beautiful people, how's it going? And welcome to a new video. So today we're going big in the double corruption chamber, taking 10 elevated strike gloves in there with us and hoping for a plus one maximum frenzy charge implicit corrupt. So yeah, obviously there's not a very wide market for these because uh, not everyone's just going in and yeeting elevated bloody gloves into the double corruption chamber. So if I were to hit plus one frenzy, they would be very, very, very expensive as it would be the best in slot for a flicker strike build. Um, so Let's take a look at the market real quick. There's only two, um, pretty much expected, and they're offline. So we've got one for 500, which is just plus one frenzy. We have plus two auras on there, which isn't too important. But yeah, just as you can see, it's um, these are similar to the rolls that I have on my gloves. 500x sounds about right because this is a very, very hard to hit, and it will just boost the DPS of most builds uh, insanely high that are frenzy stacking. So yeah, pretty good gloves there. Um, as well as this, I also have a few things that a few um, viewers want me to corrupt. So I've got six uh, Void Fletchers, courtesy of Sen03. Um, so I'm going to hit him some decent implicits on those. And then I have a Mirror Tier Watcher's Eye, which is a double hatred precision, um, crit chance, crit multi, and increased cold damage with insane rolls. Like, look at those rolls, man. That is so good. Um, courtesy of Pain123. Hopefully we won't be feeling the pain in this and it won't poof. So, yeah, I'm going to get to the double corrupts, guys. I'm going to show you the highlights as we go along, of course. And I will catch you guys when I've made, you know, 10 mirrors from, you know, 10 frenzy charges. Simple stuff. All right, guys. Just going to get it on the first one. All casual like. Boom. Ah, oh, four white sockets. They didn't brick. Still sellable. Still sellable. All right. Glove number two. Predictions. I'm going to go for a poof. Ah, he's right. Next one's going to be a double implicit. I'm calling it now. Calling it now. Okay. Third time's the charm. And I think these are the worst crafted pair I have. So naturally, this will be the one that hits the plus one frenzy. So, boom. I, I called it, but it's got despair. Oh, despair sucks. <laughs> oh, God. Plus one frenzy, but despair. Um. Um. Well, despair is definitely useless. I can't believe I called that. I knew that was going to hit the plus one frenzy. Those are the worst ones I have. I knew it. Oh, and despair is so crap. It's literally useless. Um, but I guess it might be worth running Whispers of Doom. I guess. Because despair would proc before Frostbite, right? Um, it's kind of like... It's good, but at the same time, it's like, oh, come on, man. You know what I mean? But so, yeah, that's, that's still got to be a mirror, surely. I knew it. I called it. I literally called it. Oh, man. Well, it's good nonetheless. I'm happy with that. Kind of. <laughs> Alright, guys. Next pair. By the way, I just remembered, like, those gloves have strength on them, right? As well as despair and plus one frenzy. So, maybe you could do a strength stacking flicker strike build those would use. And those would be insane, actually, now that I think about it. That would be pretty cool. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe they're actually worth a lot. Low key. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, I don't think we're going to hit enough of plus one friends, if I'm being honest. That was, that was, um, that was something else. But yeah, this one, gonna brick. Ah, same thing, same thing. Alright, let's do it quick time. Bam, bam, bam. Boom. Uh, it bricked. Satch. Satch, Satch, Satch. Damn. Not too many left now, guys. Okay. I want to hit one more double implicit before this is over. Let's do it. That's not the one, though. All right. Three pairs left. Let's go. Doom quick time. Bam. White sockets again. It's better than nothing. It's better than nothing. Two. Ah. Okay. One more. Last one. Come on. All right. Final pair of gloves. Let's go. Well, I mean, we did hit the implicit. It's not the best implicit. But it's probably sellable. Trap or mine gems is absolutely useless. But 5% increase max life is okay. I'm not sure if it's better than the 20% um, increase melee damage, though, to be honest. I mean, somebody might, might want them. Probably just resell them for about 30, 35x, something like that. Uh, okay, let's take a look over here real quick. So... Um, those, we got two double implicits, one being the plus one maximum frenzy and despair on hit, which is definitely over a mirror. It's 100% over a mirror just because plus one max frenzy is just too, too good to pass up. Um, and then you can just run a plus one curse setup somewhere in your build. 
Uh, or, you know, the Chaos Damage Flicker Strike build, if there is one, um, could use these, and that'd be pretty insane. Uh, because a Chaos Damage build is going to be Strength Stacking, most likely using the Alberons. And then this does have Strength on it as well. So maybe this is actually low key OP. Um, and then we have two four white sockets, which can just resell for their. Um, this one's about 40x, 42x, something like that. And then this one is probably. It's got the um, the order mod on it as well as the aspect and the attack speed. So this will probably sell for about 35, 40x as well. And then that's a brick. So that's it for at least my elevated uh, glove gamble. So this is definitely profit, guys. 100%. As to how much, I'm not sure. And whether these will actually sell at this point in the league. I'm, I'm Actually, I really want to keep these. I'm going to keep these. Um, so yeah, I'm keeping these. And now we'll move on to uh, Sens Void Fletchers. Just to see if we can make a bit of money. And we'll do the Watcher's Eye. So I'm going to start with the Watcher's Eye so we can... Um, Actually, actually, you know what? I just got a double implicit. I kind of don't feel like chance in that one. I know it doesn't matter, but you know, sometimes it just kind of feels a bit iffy. So yeah, we'll do the Void Fletchers. We'll save the best for last, I guess. So I will catch you in a set with the Void Fletchers. All right, send me Let's get you started with some profit. This is a terribly rolled one, so it will probably hit a double implicit as well. That's pretty good. Light and damage with bow attacks. Fist damage with extra health. That's pretty good. I told you. I, I don't know what it is, guys, but when they are rolled pretty badly, they always seem to hit a double implicit. It's kind of sus. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Uh, I'm 100% expecting that Watcher's Eye to brick. So, um, yeah, I'm not sure how much that is. That's pretty good, though. It's not obviously not super good, but uh, that's definitely a step up. All right. Void Fletcher number two. Boom. See you later. Okay, Sen. We got this lad. Okay, don't worry, we've still got three more shots. We're gonna get it. Easy. Number four. First brick. Ah. That's probably okay as well, right? I uh, I probably checked the other ones, and yeah, okay, 7x for added cold. Okay, that's nice. I don't know about fire. 1x. Is the one with two? Yeah, just 7x, just for the cold. Yep, uh, the other one was about 3x as well, so we're actually in profit now with the Void Fletcher, so big pog for Sen. Um, and we've still got one left, so, you know, we're going to hit the uh, the plus one arrow, or, you know, plus one chain, anytime now. So, uh, yeah. Alright, Sen, final one, mate. Let's get you a quick jackpot. Call it a day. Well, I mean, there you go. Alright guys, so for Sen's one, we made about, let's just check how much these are uncorrupted real quick. So these are only 70 C, so yeah, 10x um, in total for these two that actually have implicit. So Sen has made a little bit of money there, so quite pog. And now it's time to absolutely destroy this watcher's eye. So yeah, wish me the best of luck. Alright guys, pain one, two, three. Let's do it. Oh, corrupted blood plus something nice. Let's feel the pain in one, two, three. No. Oh, fuck, man. Well, I mean, what could you expect? You just know the game's going to do you over when you're doing a, a big item like that, unfortunately. Uh, well, good video to make, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. This is the end for me. We had some good runs. We made the awesome gloves. It's a shame about the Watcher's Eye. And at least Sen made some profit. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Um, take care. Good luck. Goodbye.